hi everyone welcome to our new video today we're going to show you how to bypass the problem of canon when it says that uh, you could you, you cannot print and all that so here's the problem i'm gonna come and uh, say settings i'm using ubuntu settings when I'm on settings uh, I did a double S E which is not good so I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna be here then I look for printers um, if you don't get printers you're gonna say um, you're gonna come here and search and say printers I'm using a Canon Canon what it's gonna be Canon MF 645CX right okay that's the canon we have so I'm looking for that uh, printers try to look for printers print. so if you click on printers yes when you're here we have a couple of printers here so what I'm gonna look for I'm gonna look for that canon and say add it's, you see you see now it could happen that you're gonna find this problem this one so if you click that then it's gonna be pro but if you click this it will work if you click this it won't work so let's use that and see okay once we're there um it's gonna say it's gonna look for drivers okay 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 when that is there we do what we make it as um, uh, okay then we say print uh, we're gonna say print I want to print that say okay that is the one so let me make a print out let's see word also let me select something else I'll see if it doesn't print I have the solution for you Okay, if I say printer, okay, I look for that. Okay, and say okay, print. Yeah, this is the issue. The issue says could not start. Let's tap this down for us so that we can be safe. It said what? It could not start printer. Could not start printer, please check your printer configuration okay okay it says could not start printer please check your printer configuration okay that's good so one thing which is okay after doing that what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go and delete this or remove this print no is that the print i want to no i'm looking for canon i think i removed it let me see okay well after doing that you forget that so what you do you go to your google and say google.com then you put in canon uh, mf645 sc uh, linux drivers okay then what you say when you go there it's gonna give you the canon page you click on that canon page um, so after that you're gonna say accept so then you click, click there and you go down here it's gonna give you the operating system you select what linux right uh, select linux six, linux 64 it depends on what you're using me i'm using 64 select that once selected it's gonna give you uh you can see the printer model here is the same as we're looking for up here you scroll down here you get that once with that you just click download 
after download you're gonna read and accept uh, agree with those terms and conditions I'm sorry about the background music which is not uh, intended to be in here but uh, I got to to do what to do what I have to do so you can see that the the download is going on okay once it's done I'm gonna say no to these pop-ups once it's done then we're gonna see what we're gonna do okay okay it's about to be okay it's complete well after when that is done you just click here go to downloads you find what you're looking for which is this and say extract here after extracting there you go I wanna first of all let me delete this uh, delete that delete that I wanna delete things which I don't need here which are gonna confuse us so you can see we've extracted a lot of things here um, so I'm gonna go here inside so I copy all the files here like you know I can say cut then I go back to downloads and I paste them here after pasting them there I'm gonna go to my terminal and say terminal after terminal I will say sudo so I say enter after entering that I'm gonna put in my password After doing that then you remember that we in downloads you see this file this file the it's called install.sh that's the file we're looking for so I'm gonna go to CD and I say downloads it doesn't matter where you put it but you have to know how to go there you see I'm there so I can say ls to list if I want to list ls it means I'm listing everything which is there so I'm looking for this file this one so I can copy that file and say dot forward slash I paste that here and say enter once I say enter it's gonna ask you to say yes say yes and say enter then it's installing the drivers so it will pop up something on the window to tell you to select the kind of a printer you're looking for because these drivers are for each and every Canon machine uh, not everything but I would say most of them so you're gonna say pop-up which is gonna give you a chance to select your model okay but make sure also the machine is connected to by cable that's what I've used but I haven't used it on I've used by USB not by aha uh -huh, this is the pop-up so on the pop-up you say add after adding you can look for your model number mine is down that's what i know down here mf look mf you can see mf6 mf65 645c then say okay you say okay to that okay when you say that then you can select your usb or whatever so i'm gonna select the second one you could select the first one but i'm gonna use the second one that's what I want and I double click it that's it okay 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 USB that's it you, you, you saw what I did I double clicked it then it gave me thus then say okay you can now close that after closing everything is gonna be done so I hope you got that step well I'm gonna go back to settings and uh, say add I got this now you can see right add after adding that it should look for drivers which is there already okay I'm looking for it since we added it now yeah you can see where it is it came here we're gonna make it as default 
then we open our okay, I can close this it's a print okay you can see it's here give it time give it time give it time after you say okay I didn't type even anything here so but it's printing you can hear it's a key so it's gonna print but I'm gonna also print another thing say gm and say print okay you can hear now the sound of the printer the printer is what the printer is printing Wow, that's done so nice. I wish you could see this, guys, but I'm done printing. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys, and don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video. So, we managed to solve that problem. So, see you in the next.